guys, it's Elena and welcome back to my channel. For this week's video, I'm going to be answering 60 of the randomest questions ever and I have a feeling that this video is going to be really long, so let's just get started. So just a little extra information, this is the second time filming this because I got about like a third of the way through and found out that it hadn't been filming at all, so let's just start again. Question number one is put like your music app on shuffle and then say the first six songs. So, I do not use the like music app that comes with iPhones, I just use like Spotify and SoundCloud. But these songs are going to be super old, so let's get started. If you don't know, that is Roll Up by Wiz Khalifa. It's a pretty good song, so that's number one. <laughs> number two. I only have that song for Justin Bieber's part, let's just be honest. Oh, this is a really good song that's like super old. I literally listened to this in like fifth grade, no, sixth grade, probably sixth grade. That is Lay a Little Sunshine by the Beach Girl 5, that's number three. Number four. Bang, bang, obviously. Was that number, that was number four. Number five is Life As We Know It by All Star Weekend. And number six is You Be The Anchor That Keeps My Feet On The Ground. I'll be the wings that keep your heart in the clouds by Mayday Parade. Number two is if you could meet anyone on the earth, who would it be? So, last time I did this, I said it was kind of hard to think about, but now I already know. So, if I could meet anyone, it would definitely be Morgan Freeman, because I literally love him. And, I, as I explained before, that if I met Morgan Freeman, I would sit him down on a couch, we'd get a really comfy blanket, some candles, some soothing music. I'd hand him a book, and I'd say, Morgan, read me this book so I can go to sleep. So question number three is grab the book nearest you and read page 23, line 17. And it is my favorite book. I read it while I was on vacation eighth grade year. I actually think I mentioned it in like a super old video. But anyways, it's Since You've Been Gone by Morgan Matson. I'm going to read a line before it too so it makes some more sense. Well, I'm not sure how many of these I'll, actual, I'll actually do. I said as I carefully folded the letter and placed it back in the envelope. But this is awesome of you. Thank you so much. That's it. So, Question number four is what do you think about most? And I said that I think about the future the absolute most because it's like I'm always thinking about new videos, like video ideas. I'm thinking about when I have to work. I'm thinking about tests coming up. I'm thinking about what I'm going to do over the summer, what I'm going to do over spring break. My Okay, question number five is what does your last text message say? My last text says, we just ate at pie. Uh, number six, do you sleep with or without underwear on? And I sleep with underwear on because the idea of sleeping without underwear just kind of grosses me out. Like, Number seven, what is your strangest talent? So Nick and I decided that my strangest talent is that I can, okay, I'm gonna actually stretch this time because last time I didn't stretch and it really hurt. <laughs> So basically, I can bend my arms all the way back and be straight out and like hold my hands together, which is not that cool, not that strange, but that's the best that I can do, so. Question number eight is, that, have you ever had a poem or song written about you? Yes, I have. Number nine is, do you have any strange phobias? So, I'm gonna have Nick do this because if I just even hear it or say it or just think about it, it's gonna just make me freak out, so. Afraid of oh my god, are you done? Number 10 is ever stuck a foreign object up your nose. So one time when I was like four years old, my cousin and I used to play this game where we'd like hide stuff and whoever could hide it the like we'd all have an item we'd have an item and we'd all take turns like hiding it somewhere and whoever hid it in the best place was the winner. And so we had this little itty bitty blue bee that you like, would like make like friendship bracelets with or something. 
and I, we were all sitting underneath my grandparents' kitchen table, and I thought it'd be a good idea to hide it up my nose, because who would think to find it there? So I stuck the bead up my nose, and like I said, it got stuck. So, no worries guys, the blue bead is no, no longer in my nose, so we're all good. Question number 11 is, what's your religion? So this is kind of like a hard question, I guess. Um, just because I don't really have one, but like, like I go to church with my grandparents on Easter, and I've like been to church with Nick's family sometimes, but like, I don't go to church, my parents don't go to church, it's not like every Sunday or anything like that, or any other kind of religions, special days, um, we just never really did any of that. So question 12 is, if you're outside, what are you doing? And I'm probably walking back inside because I'm definitely an indoor person. Question 13 is in front of the camera or behind it? I like to be in front and behind the camera because I love making videos and like talking to a camera but I also like editing and taking pictures so really either way is good for me. Question 14 is what are your favorite bands and my favorite bands are The Somerset and Sleeping With Sirens. If you've never heard of them you should definitely check them out. Question 15 is if yeah, question 15 is, if, is do you believe in karma and I definitely believe in karma. I definitely think that what you do will come back and reflect on you, whether it be good or bad. Question 16 is, what's your account name mean? So my account is Lane Love Music, and basically it was supposed to be a channel where I like made video or music playlists and watched videos. It wasn't supposed to be like a channel where I made videos, but then I decided I wanted to make videos, and I was like, hey, I already have the account, so boom, this channel was born. 17 is, have you ever gone skinny dipping? And no, but I would really like to. 18 is, how do you vent your anger? Usually by yelling at Nick, so. 19 is, do you have a collection of anything? I collect snow globes from every state that I go to, but I just started this over the summer, this past summer, so I don't have that many yet, but I'm working on it. Uh, 20 is, do you prefer talking on the phone or FaceTime? And definitely talking on the phone because if I'm on FaceTime, I'm basically just looking at myself and making sure that I look good, so what's the point? 21 is, are you happy with the person that you are? And I'd say that I'm pretty happy. 22 is, what's a sound you hate? My dog barking. I hate it a lot. And what's a sound you love? Uh, ooh, I love the sound of rain a lot. Question 23 is, do you believe in ghosts or aliens? Definitely believe in ghosts. Aliens are kind of iffy about. 24 is, stick your right arm out. What do you touch? Bed. Do the same thing with your left. Bed. <laughs> what do you smell? I don't smell anything. Do you smell anything? Well, Nick can smell himself, so, I mean, that works. 26 is, what's the worst place you've ever been to? I might go with school. 27 is East Coast or West Coast? Um, I don't know. I've always, like, I would rather live on the West Coast when I was younger, and then once I was older and, like, had a family, I'd rather live on the East Coast. Uh, 28 is most attractive singer of the opposite sex. Ooh, that's hard. I just... I just thought Justin Bieber. That's who came to mind first, so we're just going to go with that. 29 is, what is the meaning of life? To eat chocolate. That's what we're all here for. 30 is, do you believe in luck? And, I don't know. 31, what's the weather like right now? It is cloudy, but it's not too chilly. It's just like a little breezy. 32 is, what's the time? It is currently 4.28 p.m. 33, do you drive? Yes. Have you ever crashed? No, but I've come close. 34 is, what was the last book you read? And the last book that I read was... So the last book that I read was First Love, How I Ran Away from Home and Fell in Love with My Best Friend by James Patterson. 35, do you have any nicknames? Yes. Let's see. Um, Missy Lou, Lainey, Laneybug, Bug. Lena. 36 is what was the last movie you saw? The last movie that I saw at the movie theater was The Fifth Wave that I saw with Nick on our anniversary. Um, 37 is what's the worst injury you've ever had? I've never really had any bad injuries. 38 is have you ever caught a butterfly? And I feel like I've like caught one in my hand 
but I've never like caught one and kept one. 39 is any obsessions. I have way too many obsessions. I obsess over Jane the Virgin and Rain and Scandal and Bachelor and Once Upon a Time. I obsess over clothes. I obsess over Justin Bieber. 40 is sexual orientation and I am straight. Uh, 41, ever had a rumor spread about you? Probably. 42, do you believe in magic? I think that there are people out there that can do magic. 43, do you hold grudges? Yeah, it's kind of a problem. 44, what is your sign? I am a Libra. 45, saver or spender? I don't know, like I don't, I don't like spending my own money that much, but I do spend it and I do spend other people's money, which sounds really bad, so I'm gonna go with spender. 46 is, what's the last thing you purchased? I think was my outfit for the Justin Bieber concert next month. 47, love or lust? Definitely love. 48, relationship status? Taken. Happily taken. He definitely just avoided my kiss. Okay. 49, how many relationships have you had? So basically, that depends on what you consider a relationship. Four, five, six. I've had six. If we only include, like, people that I've kissed, then that would be four. Okay, 50 is, can you touch your nose with your tongue? No. I tried, though. 51 is, where were you yesterday? So I went to school. Then I came home and watched a uh, Bachelor with my mom. Um, 52, is there anything pink within 10 feet of you? this pillow right here. Uh, 53, are you wearing socks? No. 54, favorite animal. My favorite animal is a bear. I freaking love bears. 55, what's your secret weapon to getting someone to like you? So, my thing that I always used to do when I was flirting with guys is I'm the type of person that like picks on them. Like I'm like the equivalent of like a elementary school boy chasing a girl around the playground. Like, I'm a person I like to pick on guys a lot. 56 is, where is your best friend? And let me just hop onto this group message because we all share our, our locations with each other. Let's see where Keely's at. Apparently, Keely does not share her location anymore. 57 is, what is your heritage? So, I'm being just really general my mom is white my dad is black 58 what were you doing last night at 12 a.m. sleeping I went to bed at 10 30 last night and I'm very happy about it 59 what is Satan's last name I think it's Smith like Satan Smith that was a good ring to it don't you think it does and then 60 be honest ever gotten yourself off come on that was the random 60 questions ever. I really hope you enjoyed. I really hope that I actually get to do all 60 questions because if not, this is going to be awkward. So I love you guys so much. I will see you in next week's video. Bye. Oh my God, this is so much farther than usual.